Hello and welcome back to Pokemon Heart Gold Ashlock Challenge. As always, I am the Ixalan, and you may be wondering why we're back in this freaking gym. And the answer is this woman owes me something. You kept me waiting. Here, take this. I don't know why I'm a gangster now. Tang TM 59. That contains Dragon Pulse. Dragon Pulse is a kind of. Um, never mind! That's oddly sexual, I think. <laughs> It's a huge energy of some kind. If you don't want it, you don't have to take it. What's the matter? Aren't you headed to the Pokemon League? Your face. It tells me that you have some unfinished business. That's that's kind of the voice I want for Claire, because Claire is kind of a biatch. Wait a sec. You came from New Bark Town, where Professor Elm's lab is? You may want to go back there and start all over again, because you suck. Because I'm a biatch. Don't you dare give up, though, because if I lost to you and then you lose, that's going to piss me off because somehow that makes me worse than I already am. All right. Well, anyways, the whole reason that we came back in here to get that is I looked into uh, the potential second uh, Pokemon that we could get back here in Dragon's Den. And there is one that we can get. Oh, wait. We need to not go here. I actually need to... It's a gift Pokemon. Once you get... Dragon Pulse from Claire, the clan leader, that old guy, will give us something. But I have to deposit a Pokemon real fast, so let me do that real fast. Okay, so basically, uh, here's how this runs down. If you're kind of new to the series or haven't really been watching it, um, this season we have we have a Butterfree Returns Clause, I think is what I called it. And basically it amounts to when I'm gifted a Pokemon, instead of using that Pokemon... I can trade it um, for a Pokemon that we had in a previous edition. Uh, and that includes um, like things that we may have released earlier if we couldn't use them for some reason. So basically what it amounts to is we can't use Den we can't evolve Denryu because of our bad luck die. So I think I'm gonna retire Denryu um, before we go like into the Pokemon League, which means I can replace Denryu. So there's kind of two options here for replacing Denryu. I can just use Krill, which is a Dratini we caught in the last episode. And I would be very happy to use a Dratini for the Pokemon League, because that'll just decimate Lance. Um, on, the down on the other side, like the primary reason for using a Dragon type is to fight other Dragon types, or just for its natural resistances. So I mean, we could. Or we could use one of our Pokemon from Fire Red that didn't die, and we could kind of bring it in. Now, we've already done this with uh, with Golbat and with Bill, our Flareon. Um, but we, and, and, you know, we started with Shades. And we've unfortunately lost all of them. Uh, nickname him Trady Magoo. Trady Magoo. Oh my god, it's gonna fit. That's the best part about this. Trady Magoo. You have shown that you can be entrusted with one, which you will immediately turn into another one. So basically, yeah, I'm going to leave this up to you guys. Um, I'll keep Denryu on the team for a little while until I get some feedback. But if you guys want me to use the Dratini Krill, I would be more than happy to do that. Or if you want me to use one of our Pokemon from our previous generation. And just for those of you who are kind of new, maybe haven't seen the series, I did go ahead and get kind of a rundown of what we're looking for. And so we could bring back a Hypno. We could bring back our Rapidash. And we could bring back, or sorry, not and. We could bring back, we had a Magneton. We also had a Snorlax. A Gyarados. We had a Voltorb, which would be an interesting challenge. And would probably be a de well, both Magneton and Voltorb would be decent replaces for um, Denryu since they're electric types. Uh, we also had a Pidgey, <laughs> which would get us a flying type back. That'd be kind of nice. Hitmonlee, Meowth, Doduo, another flying type. Uh, Horsey, Ghastly. I'm not really keen on Ghastly because I can't get him in. I can't evolve him into Gengar, and we already have one. We already have uh, Mikey, who's stuck at uh, at Machoke level, can't ever be a Machamp, which is kind of sad. And then we have a Venonat, a Goldeen, a Lapras, Psyduck. Krabby, Primeape, and Tangela. 
And Tangela we could evolve into Tangrowth in this generation. So that's pretty cool. Um, that's also a good contender. So any of those, um, let me know what you thought in the comments. Let me know what you thought. Let me know what you think in the comments below. And in a couple episodes, we'll bring one of them on or we'll just go with Krill. So yeah, thanks. So the other thing to note in this episode, which is kind of important, is last episode, I referred to Pillow Swine here as a Mammoth Swine. And he's not. He's definitely a Pillow Swine. But... We do have Pokemon to catch here. Well, we have the potential to catch a Pokemon here in Route 45. So we're going to do that. And then we're actually going to try to work on getting Pillow Swine evolved into a Mammo Swine. Um, so, did we ever have a Geodude? I feel like we've had a Geodude and a Graveler. We did. And I think he died. Yeah, he did. He definitely did. So we can't catch this Pokemon. Let's try an Ice Shard. Pretty good. So we can't catch this one. Um, so we get three more chances. And then what we're going to do is we're going to go north into the Dark Cave. Because that's where we can potentially get a... Whoa! Gliger. Yeah. Okay. This is our catch for this area if we can. Can I Secret Power it? That won't kill you. Will it? Please don't kill it. Oh, and it fell asleep! Oh, secret power, perfect. Alright, we're just gonna go straight with the... What does that ball work on? Water and bug? He's not either of those. Love ball. That's cool. Ah, ultra ball. Sweet. Glygor evolves into Gliscor, which is a super good Pokemon. Well, maybe not super good, but it has, it has a really good moveset. It's actually... Well, no, I would say super good. Yeah, it's probably super good. Competitively, anyways. Um, at least it was back in black and white. I'm not super familiar with the metagame pros and cons of X and Y generation Pokemon. Um, a female bat gliding vampire, uh, Elvira? We've already had an Elvira. I can't name you Elvira. Man, I'm gonna name you. Pris Priscilla? That's not how you spell this, is it? It's one S? Priscilla? Is it a C? Her name is Prissy. <laughs> My ability to not spell was awful. So yeah, there we go. We uh, we caught Percy, the Gligor, soon to be Gliscor, and that could potentially be an option for us in uh, in our replacement to add to that list earlier, in addition to Krill. So I, I went ahead and I don't have, apparently since, let me rephrase, let me start from coherent sentences, right? Because that's probably pretty important for you guys to understand what the hell I'm saying. Uh, I don't have Flash, because Flash is on HM in this generation. So what I do have is the dedication to actually make it through this area. And we're totally going to... I've already repelled up. We've been through the Dark Cave. Nothing here is, I think, over like level 10 or something. So there's some items to get, but more importantly than any of that, uh, there are some rocks that we have to break to get heart scales. And that's really what I'm all about. I want to get some heart scales. And I... The Dark Cave is apparently just like one big area. So I shouldn't... Like, we shouldn't have too much difficulty. Plus I also got... Uh, I'm not going to lie. I got a map. <laughs> I'm not going to pretend like I don't have a map. Because that would be... That would be false advertisement to you people. There's an item here that we're going to get. Okay, we got false swipe. That's pretty good. And then we're going to head back this way and get in the water. And there's a trainer to fight. So there's a couple trainers in here. But most, mostly what we're looking to get is into the area where there's rocks that we can break. So that we can rock smash, which Bully has. And potentially get a heart scale. And if you're wondering, why the hell does he need a heart scale? What are you going to do with a heart scale, the Ixalan? Well, Pillow Swine, which is what this guy is right now, evolves into Mammo Swine when he knows ancient power and levels up and to get ancient power 
he starts with it. Like, you get it as a starting move. Unfortunately, since we caught him at level 20, whatever, that we caught him at, um, since we got him at level 20, he'd already replaced that move with some other crappy move. <laughs> And uh, and we can't level up. We can't evolve into Mammoth Swine right now. So the counterpoint to that is, let's fight this guy. Whoa! You startled me. I had my black glasses on, so I didn't notice you at all. Hey, don't you worry about it. I'll give you a pair of black glasses. So forget you saw me. I thought I was gonna have to fight this guy. I mean, I know what black glasses do because we have them. Well, we had the munchades. So now our goal is. To go back the way we came. If we can. If I can figure out how to do this. And I, I believe down in this left corner over here is the exit into the next area. And if I had flight or like... If I, if I had flight, I would have looked into getting a new TM. But unfortunately, I don't have flight, so... I mean, what are you going to do, right? So I believe we can... I'm looking at the map for a second. So how do we do that? So there's that's the only way to exit. So once we go past these rocks, like to the left, that's the exit onto um, that route near New Bark Town. I would like to rock smash all of these rocks. Give me one heart scale, that's all I'm asking of you. That's a battle. Oh, it's a Dunsparce. Unfortunately, we wasted all of our catches in here, if I remember correctly. So I can't catch this, so I'll just get rid of it. Dunsparce is, I think, a normal type with Levitate. I've never really used it in combat, or actually ever seen it used, because I don't I don't think it has a very good like move pool. But I could be wrong. Somebody somewhere probably uses it. That's That's all I can really say on that. So there's definitely two items to the left um, that I'm not super concerned with getting. I'm more concerned with potentially getting a heart scale, which is really what we're trying here. But there's not that many rocks to break, which is kind of the problem. And instead, we're fighting Pokemon instead of getting what it wants. So I'm looking at the map, and there's only one more breakable rock, which is kind of scary. <laughs> We're not even going to fight him. It's not worth it. I'm sorry, Dunsparce. You're just... You're not good enough. So we're going to... Can we rock... We can't rock smash these, can I? No. Okay. So there's one more for the chance to get a heart scale. And if we don't do that... I don't know. I guess... I guess we could walk in and out of breaking this thing, like, repeatedly. That seems kind of grindy to me. Hey, Lyra. Hello. This is Lyra. How are you? I'm doing well. I just... All right. Whatever. You know, if you go to the Lake of Rage, you can see just how energetic Magikarp can be. Uh, it's a Saturday, and so it's not a Wednesday, so the Lake of Rage is not, like, down on its luck or however you want to call that. I don't know. Or lowered. Low tide. That's down on its luck to low tide. <laughs> That's a sentence. That's what I said. Uh, Alright, so we've got a couple more items. We're just going to grab these items on our way out. And the last rock will be over here. So it's pretty much just extra money at this point. But we did Route 45. There it is. There it is. Yes. Break rock. Give me heart scale. I'm like so sad that this is a Geodude and not a heart scale. I just want a heart scale. Alright, well, that was the Dark Cave. Um, we're on Route 46, though, so can I go through here? Oh, extra apricorns, which Route 46 here is, I don't remember where this was on the map compared to where we need to be, but I know it's obviously further south of Route 45, so there's the potential for another catch here, question <laughs> mark. Um, we didn't get what we needed to get Pillow Swine here to evolve, sadly. Oh, this is Route 45. Are there trainers? Did we miss? We may have missed out on the trainers. There's no going back through 45. It's just Dark Cave only. 
the hell is the point of the dark cave? Eventually we'll get rock climb and be able to go up there. But for now, ooh, there's a guy. Oh, there's plenty of guys. Oh. Let's do this. Let's make this interesting. I'm super excited now. We walked through there pretty fast. Didn't really get what we wanted, but hey. Mankey set. Oh, Mankey 17. Oh. Will this kill him in one hit? Let's find out. Yes. Yes, it will, gentlemen. Player defeated Camper Ted. Alright. Let's go over here. X speed. Okay. Yeah, come fight me. That's fine. I don't really care. Oh, she raises Pokemon too. She must be ready for a battle. Picnicker Aaron sent out Ponyta. Aww. Uh, secret power. That'll probably kill you, I guess. Yeah. I thought about using Ice Shard, but it was probably not gonna win because fire resists ice, so even though it's stab, it would have been much lower damage. It probably would have lived with like one HP and been like really annoying, so I just went with the secret power because that's pretty much a guaranteed kill. Oh bleh. Poor Aaron. Uh yeah, I'll battle you again. Shit yeah. Come back in like the 30s, give me some XP. Nice. Alright. Oh, here we go. Did we potentially Did we have the potential to catch a Pokemon here? Did we already come to Route 46? Like at the beginning of the series? I don't remember. We're probably not going to find anything in four, four Pokemon anyways, because the game hates me. Rattata. Rattata level four. I feel like we came here and I'm going to pretend, I'm going to go with we did. Yeah. Okay. So then I think we're done. There's a, uh, let me get out of the grass here. Talk to you. Yeah. Cause I think we could walk into this grass, but we couldn't go up any further. And so we just tried to catch. I don't know what we tried to catch. Oh, we didn't. We didn't see anything. That was the issue, because it's just Geodude and Spiros and Rattatas. Yep. And then Mount. Yep. Mountain Road ahead. Oh, we did it. All right, guys. Well, we caught a new Pokemon on Route 45. We didn't get the Heart Skills we wanted on Route 46. Maybe we'll have better luck somewhere else. I don't know. I'll check again. I might check in between episodes. No, I'd have to walk all the way back. I won't do that. All right, well, we're stuck with Pillow Swine until we get flight somehow. <laughs> Choose a Pokemon that gives me flight. <laughs> uh, so, yeah, remember to let me know in the comments below who you want to see replace Denryu because we're going to retire our poor Pokemon that can't evolve and hopefully get something a little bit better. We'll see. And in the next episode, we'll go to New Bark Town and actually get the Master Ball and take it from there. So, thanks for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed. If you did, please consider leaving a like, and I'll see you next time. Bye.